Not so Freudian here. Welcome back to Let's Play The Binding of Isaac Afterbirth Dailies. Alright, looks like we are Eve today. Cellar 1. Um, yeah, her tears start out red, but it took her four shots to kill that thing. It is not an XL floor. And it takes three shots to kill one of those spiders. Okay. Looks like I'm gonna risk a heart by, uh, walking over the, uh, spikes to get that, um, alright, this is bullcrap. <laughs> uh, yeah, but I'm going to be risking a full heart to, um, Kind of cool if uh, well, and it would make Dead Bird better if it got kind of a uh, okay, cool. I really don't want to go to the big room, but um, sweet. Uh, how am I trying to put it? Yeah, if it was like. I mean, in at least, I'll take that, yeah, at least third edition Dungeons and Dragons, you could, um, like a wizard or a sorcerer with a familiar, at, I don't remember what level it started working at, but you could, um, basically use touch attacks through your familiar. <sighs> okay, so that bit. Alrighty. <sighs> Let's get back to full health. <laughs> and again, like yesterday, I'm like, odds are I'm not doing boss rush here. I'm perfectly willing to use my key to hopefully get a, um... a key and a soul heart out of the shop. Or if there's a really great item, I can, uh... Maybe blow up the shopkeeper with my last bomb. Wait, did I really just realize that the reason... Hang on, why isn't the stream working? The reason the keeper is called the keeper is because he's a sh like literally a shopkeeper. All right, there's no key. I was hoping that would be worth it, but it wasn't. I sure hope the recording's working. Although the um, 
preview pane is. It says it's streaming and recording, but for some reason the stream still tells me I'm offline. That's probably a library. Okay, cool. Alright, that is probably what I'm going to keep. Did, did Gaz just give me two soul hearts? Or am I... What's going on? Actually... Oh yeah, I got rid of the razor blade, duh. I didn't pick up a soul heart anywhere, did I? Sweet. I like Mysterious Liquid a lot. Okay, drop it there. Ooh, awesome. I kind of wish I'd been able to pick up car battery. But oh well. I just need a bomb. It'd be kind of cool if, like, there was actual splash damage instead of just leaving creep. Or however you pronounce it. Oh, thank you. That was really close. That worked out better than I expected. Give me one that time, so I must have gotten a soul heart somewhere else. I am gonna go to the curse room after I fight this guy. Alright, this guy gets annoying. The mysterious liquid make my tears a lot smaller. I hope it's not a damage down. Every time he hits himself, that's like a quarter of his health. Oh man. Ah, this guy is really annoying early on. Okay. Hormones. Please let me trade away a heart. Okay. I guess I'll take my shadow. Okay. Because it lets me go, Whore of Babylon. I thought this was a. Okay, that was. Seems I'm not as a zone. And my range hasn't really been bothering me. That monster maybe doesn't leap. Oops. I really shouldn't have been hit by Larry Jr., especially since I had a friggin'. Hit him and then he just kind of drags himself over it. 
but stream configuration quality incompatible. That makes no sense. of the creep I make. Okay. Oh jeez. Holy crap, I got stuck and managed to not die. Let's go sit here. Probably not worth it. I don't like these things because the angles their shots come out at are unpredictable. I don't like these guys because they just shoot so quickly and their shot speed is so high. These guys are fine. It's the ones that shoot three at, like, at different angles that annoy me. A lot of keys all of a sudden. I guess I take Betrayal because it keeps me in Horror of Babylon. My range is still pretty good and that makes it easier to hit. And I mean you guys know how bad I am at aiming. Flooded Caves. Yeah, I'm still not getting to boss rush. But I'm getting to the point where I might consider myself strong enough to try. Okay, I thought I was out of range there. I wonder if Degas does anything. That's usually the second secret room, I think. No. If you have Curse of the Labyrinth. Like, whether... You, I mean, I know it won't get rid of the Curse of the Labyrinth, but I wonder if you get any sort of... Uh, you know, bonus. 
or uh, what's the term? Like compensation for not losing Curse of the Labyrinth. Another tinted rock that turned into a regular chest. Dagons. Oh, well, holistic. Then it gave me a kind of standard tinted rock payout anyway. mom's key, doesn't it? If you turn your head to the right, that room looks like mom's key. This could be interesting. I know it's probably awful and a terrible idea. kind of thing where if I can show you guys what it's doing <laughs> or like because I think it stays the same for everyone you know so the stuff I just got is the same that you're going to get if you use or if you go in and pick that up so if you're watching this to see whether you should pick it up or not, you're welcome. I... I must have Virgo or... I, oh yeah, that, that M is Virgo, isn't it? Well, that is a second... nice that my soul heart generation isn't linked to, like, Dark Bum or something that's going to get re-rolled every turn. Uh, Guillotine, of course. I also got the transformation that puts stuff on my... Okay, that is hilarious. By hilarious, I mean utterly ridiculous. And kind of awesome. Because I'm just going to be, you know, putting so many shielded tears out in so many directions. I forgot to put my glasses on anyway, so I'm not going to be... You know, that's not going to affect much. I went to the shop on the last floor, right? Somebody went to the shop on the last floor. <sighs> Stupid mask. I I can get back to full health. Interesting that uh, missing missing no didn't give me any heart containers. So the odds of not re-rolling are some. I must have fruitcake because some of my shots are hanging in the air like it's uh, um, anti-grav. I 
also must have infestation too. This secret room a lot of the time. Oh, bomber boy. I guess I could have seen that if I looked over to the right first. I've got a lot of luck upgrades. That's an interesting room. I don't know if I've ever seen it before. But yeah, there's no way I'm making it to boss rush. Maybe hush. Although, I'm even if I'm on time, I'm probably not going to do it. Because I'm not. Because since it's its own floor, I won't know what I'll have for it until I'm actually there. cannon. And I don't want to wind up with like soy milk and nothing useful. If I can help it. Alright. It's basically an item that doesn't get rid of blank card that becomes a different item. Next floor. I have no idea where my body is. I must have bloody lust. Basically just traded a full spirit heart for half a black heart. Yeah, that room to the left was going to be a dead end because there's no place for the next room to go. Cement 
hits these guys from the front sometimes. I have been to the shop here, right? Uh, yes. So we'll just fight long. Or both bosses. It's an XL floor. All the bandages is just something else that becomes another item. I don't think the Polaroid rerolls though. Since we're going to the uh, cathedral, I can choose, and the cathedral is honestly a whole lot more useful than the negative. Or the Polaroid is a whole lot more useful than the negative. Especially if I get a double deal. And get rid of my last red heart. Container. Full red. Heart. I'll totally take both of these just cause. Even though I'll lose the Maw of the Void bonus, I'm getting enough hearts out of Degas, and the fact that I'm shooting, you know, all three. Alright, Bob's brain. That's kind of cool. Triple shot, I guess. Oh, I see Polyphemus over there. Probably not going to mess with Retrovision. Okay, no curse. Looks like I'm Basil Bub. I got the fly wings going. Strange attractor too. Gotta remember to use that as often as possible because I'm not at the health cap anymore. Bob's brain hit me. Jeez. Oh yeah, I don't have nuns habit anymore. There's a lot of heads I can get out of stone chests. What did Bob's brain just hit? So told me I have soy milk or something. So I would think with Polyphemus I would be doing a lot more damage. Jesus tongue, I think that just decreases the cost of devil deals. Well, it decreases the two heart container deals to one heart container deals. But it seems I've only got one heart container anyway. Oh yeah, I can fly now. I need to remember about Bob's brain, because that almost hit me again. Oh. Apparently I also have Leo or um You have soy milk. No wonder I'm doing no damage. Well, hopefully this means I won't ever get soy milk again. Man, what's the other one that lets you break rocks? Uh, thunder thighs. I would be doing a perfectly reasonable amount of damage without for soy milk. I mean, the 
the worst part is I'm still not doing awful. Unfortunately, I can't afford contact from below. Alright, Ipecac, Fruitcake, Cricket's Body, Proptosis Spoonbender. Alright, this is terrifying. I mean, holy crap. I have no idea what the beam of light coming out of my face is. Little Gertie. Little Gertie's kind of cute, actually. Did I really pick up? Yeah, I actually did pick up um, IV bag and leave uh, my car behind. No, 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 no. Get me back to max HP. Open these because, hey, Cricket's head. Like, if I get nothing else. Wow. <sighs> well, that was interesting. I don't even know what combination that was. Oh, hey, Dark Bum. Holy son of a crap. At least that was a dead end. But what on earth happened there? I'm like, everything that exploded, exploded into a bunch of littler explosions. Okay. What if I still have nuns happened? Holy son of a... I mean... Uh, I promise I have no idea what to do to, like, not just die here. But I guess I do that. I could just let Daddy Longlegs do all the killing. Stupid chasing me down at the cack. A dead end. As good as a is, the mix with fruit cake. I get hit, I send out more explosions. I mean, I, I, I've, I have no idea what's doing that. I hope this one is just like absurdly powerful, so... I get, you know, on spun. Okay, I was hoping this would be, like, incredibly powerful. Doesn't quite look like it, though. Just kind of to make up for the last floor. You know, kind of a 
if you survived this, you deserve a really amazing reroll. Or at least I can probably stay at max HP. Wow, I'm really doing almost no damage. That's not good. I do have Holy Mantle, so that's something. This is the floor I wish I'd gotten Shield of Tears. No way amazing in Genesis. with the amount of money I have and holy mantle that's actually that could actually be amazing some way to tell which of your tears was going to. I must have turdy touch too. So when I hit the enemies, they, um, or like when I touch the enemies, they get turned to gold poop. That's cool. Okay, everything drops something. that experimental treatment that jacked up my damage from 
so badly. I mean, because I got spun. Spun is a damage bonus, I think. planning on then do that because now I can still use the gas once if I'm about to die or I was gonna say if there's a better I can pick that up and still be at half a heart I was gonna see if there's a better card in there but special bombs I do not what's blocking all these shots that should be hitting me. Well, I thought I would be invincible still. Sixth place. That's not bad considering as I started this an hour later than I normally do. Um, thanks for watching. Uh, tomorrow's sh I should start at about the same time. Uh, and then, you know, just depending on how long it goes will depend on when it goes up on YouTube. But thanks for watching. I will see you guys tomorrow.